Hey students, welcome to episode seven of Hey Students. Some weird stuff happened this week. I kind of hurt myself and I'm gonna talk about that first after this little intro. I hurt my foot, so I'm gonna be probably limping for a while. In the video when I'm talking about it, we were at Costco at the time and I needed somewhere to film it because it was just hurting so bad walking on it and I wanted to take off the bandage. But I wanted to film what the bandage looked like first. Don't worry, I don't show anything gross. But I went into the bathroom to do it but I realized when I was watching it that like I'm in the bathroom. Don't worry, I'm not using the bathroom. I'm just sitting there um, talking so I could have some privacy to talk at Costco. <laughs> Anyway, it might be a little weird, but it's fine. This will be a fun episode. We'll talk about some fun stuff. Let's uh, let's talk about this little injury. I got. So I'm gonna tell you guys about something crazy that happened. I was outside working in the garden and my son Theo was out there and he was like messing with something and I was gonna be like, no, don't touch that. And I ran toward him. I stepped on this thing, this piece of metal that had broken off of one of our gardening tools and it went in through my shoe into my foot really far. And we are now at Costco. <laughs> and it's killing me. Uh, so I wanted to take off the bandage. I wanted to show you what the bandage looked like before I took it off. But here's the shoe I was wearing. Um, it went through right there. And it's pretty crazy right there. There's the, there's where it came through. And I'm not gonna show you the injury, but here's the bandage went in right here. Whew, hurt really bad. I'm probably gonna be limping for the next week or two, or I don't know how long, because it went, it probably went about that far into my foot. I had to pull it out, it was crazy. Anyway, when we get home, I'll show you what the thing looks like that I stepped on. Like I said, I was working in the garden. This thing broke, and it fell like that. And this part was sitting on the ground, and I stepped on it really hard. I like jumped on it basically and it went all the way into my shoe, probably that far, so probably about that much of it, probably that much of it went into my foot. Yeah, ouch. So I wanted to talk a little bit about the guitar. First off, I am not a guitar player. I'm not very good at it. I only know how to play the cowboy chords and like a few little things. Um, I have some friends who are very good guitar players and I do not claim to be good at it. I think it's fun. I picked up a guitar when I was in high school as a teenager, mostly because I wanted to impress girls. The way I learned how to play the guitar was I had a poster in my room that had all of the chords on it. A bunch of the easy, just open chords, the cowboy chords on it, like C, F, G, D minor, A minor, E minor. Anyway, and so I, I just taught myself. Um, I think, I'm pretty sure my technique is incorrect. I don't know the actual names of the chords. Um. <laughs> um, I like to hold the guitar down here. But I, I, I made up names for the way my hand looks while I'm doing them. <laughs> So what I would do is, as a, as a teenager, I would just look at the dots on the chart and I just figured out how to play that way. So then, this is bear claw. Okay, um, turkey leg. And old lady. I don't even know if you're supposed to put your thumb like back here or I, I usually do it like this. Old lady. When I play, which I'm pretty sure is wrong. Old lady. Or I have it all the way down in my hand, but I don't know. I think some people play like this. But I, I don't know, it's more, it's more comfortable for me to play in like this classical way in here. And since this is so small and I have a gut, I usually put it up here, even <laughs> with this small guitar. I've been playing a lot lately, mostly for my son. When we put him to bed, we'll sing to him. And so I've learned some church songs in like a bunch of different keys. Another thing I like to do is when students come in, I haven't done this very much this year yet, but sometimes when I'm in just these silly moods, I'll just get out the guitar and I'll just sing to students. <laughs> so I'll be like, hey little Tommy, you're here in my classroom. I'll, I'll ask a student, like, okay, hey, tell me tell me something to sing about, and they'll be like, burritos. So they'll be like, I love burritos, I wear them on my head, and then I eat them, but I try not to eat 
eat them in my bed. I make really dumb songs that way. So students, if I'm ever in like a silly mood, just tell me to like, just tell me to sing you a song and just give me something to sing about and I'll just make it up. Here we go, recycling. Recycling is good to do because you don't want to make the world smell like poo. I probably just embarrassed myself. That is what I do all the time, every day. Just, just every day is embarrass myself. It's fun. This is, a, this is like the poster I had on my wall when I was a teenager and it just, like here's the C major chord. You put your third finger here, you put your second finger on that fret and you put your four, first finger on that fret. Easy. And then I would look up songs like this one and look it has the lyrics and then it has the chord symbols above. D minor, G7, G7 again. And so you would just see like, okay, I need to know that chord. Where is that E? So I just need to find E minor. See, here's the minor. So we can go down here. There, that's how you do E minor. It's pretty easy. Do any of you students like just pick up stuff sometimes and you just pretend that it's a spaceship. I, I have done that ever since I was a kid. Even now as an adult, I do that. So sometimes I'll just pick up something random like this thing and I'll just be like It's a trap! There's always an explosion at the end. So I just wanted to show you guys randomly um, one of my favorite decorations I have in my room. This is a Spider-Man poster that my dad gave me. He was gonna sell it at a garage sale. I think he said he wanted like, he wanted like 10 bucks for it or something. And I was like, I'll give you a dollar. And he was like, no, <laughs> he like really wanted me to pay for it. And I just didn't. And then eventually he just gave it to me. <laughs> Thanks dad, you're cool. <laughs> with cheapskate. This was fun, this was fun. Hey students, this was fun. So thank you for watching this episode of Hey Students, I had tons of fun. Yes, I had fun. Thank you for watching this episode. Please like and subscribe if you want and I will catch you on the flippity students well some of you aren't that little but to the little ones and the big ones and the ones in the middle and the outside people that are also here this is for you i bet this is super cringy to you and if you're still watching thank you for watching oh my gosh please stop singing mr boat i hate it when you sing mr boat um, don't let anyone tell you that you're not real cool Every single one of you, no matter where you're from or who you are, you're cool, you're cool, you're cool, you are cool. Blah.